too far away from my hometown With my family I am bound I stick by them till I'm in the ground We have made it to the Netherlands. We are in Amsterdam. And the first things that we notice, obviously the architecture. Absolutely amazing. However, another first thing we noticed is the trash. The trash that's everywhere. It is a Sunday, so I'm sure Saturday was a very fun night for a lot of people. There's trash literally everywhere. But I do think it's trash day, right? Because we saw a bunch of trash trucks and street sweepers. Although our first impression wasn't exactly what we expected with all the trash being everywhere, we were not going to let that affect our opinion or our experience of Amsterdam. We kind of just chalked it up as a wild Saturday night. So we began our time in Amsterdam eating because uh, we like eating. Yeah, <laughs> yummy. <laughs> we ate pancakes, we ate like stooped waffles, we ate popsicle be treats so don't mind our diet in this video because it was a sugar filled feast and also stay until the end of the video because we have some more life-changing decisions that we need to make concerning this trip and also to find out where we're going next <laughs> actually the royal palace here in Amsterdam. So I have a fun fact for you. King Louis the first of Holland actually transformed the town hall into what is now the royal palace. So it was originally a town hall but then King Louis came and he saw all the attributes that he wanted in a palace and so he transformed it into the royal palace and it's actually one of three palaces in all of the Netherlands that the royal monarchs can use to this day. So after the pancakes and the lattes and the candy, we figured we would keep the sugar high going because that's the smart thing to do. But, so we went and got Stroopwafel because when you're in Amsterdam, you have to get the Stroopwafel. What is a Stroopwafel, do you ask? That's a great question because I had no idea until we went to go get them. I had no idea. Did you have any idea what they were? A Stroopwafel? Uh, yummy! They're yummy. What they are, like two thin wafer doughy cookie things lathered in caramel and smushed together. Sometimes dipped in chocolate. They're like, whatever, like whatever those were called. Like mm. we had them like, like if you guys took tacos. Yeah, they kind of look like flat tacos. It was delicious. Yummy? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you, was a yummy cookie? The yummy cookie? Cookie! <laughs> oh. Instagram! No. Follow at Maxine Lee underscore Y. So this morning we decided to head to the Hansel and Gretel Pancake House here in the Netherlands and it looks absolutely unbelievable. It looks so much fun for the kids. So right now Maxine went in with the big kids to get the table set up and everything. I'm in here with the babies. Cecilia is asleep napping. Some of the other babies were as well but now they're up and snacking. So that's always good before breakfast. The reason we do it that way is because most times when we get to a table, if we all go at once and the babies sit down and then they get antsy and then there's not food there, there's nothing to do. So we've been doing this thing where 
no matter where we are. If we want to sit down and enjoy a meal, Maxine and the big kids typically always go into the restaurant. I tend to walk around with the babies if we're in a city or a town or sit in the car with the babies until the table is ready. It has just made our experiences so much better with eating out. So this is how we're doing things right now. And it's working, we're happy, and I'm just waiting on a text. Babe, look at Theo. Look at Theo. <laughs> Theo! Bubba! You have a big nose! Big nose! The letter in my wallet I'll keep it till we meet again Dude, you holding on? Good job. See the tree? Whoa. Bubba, you're gonna get sprayed. Thank you, boy. <laughs> Ooh. Is that nice? Ah. Wow. Wow. Whoa. And look, it's been the winter too. As long as I'm there with you, cause you're on my mind. The only one to reach inside. The only one on my mind. We'll meet again. So as this adventure continues, we're starting to make some realizations along the way. And the main one is we 100% love traveling. We love traveling more than anything. But we're starting to realize that we may need a home base of some sort. But we have our trip booked out until like mid-July. Um, will we keep traveling full time without a home base? Maybe. Will we find a home base and do that and then travel periodically, maybe. Um, we're not 100% sure, but we know that we have to make some life-changing decisions. Oh yeah, one more thing. Next week, we are traveling to... Deutschland! <laughs> Germany! <laughs> good job, dude. Say bye. Bye! <laughs> Alright, dude, good job.